Good morning. This is Parvez Amadrishi and welcome to my uh, vlog. And today we are talking about assisting in operations. And it is presented by Dr. Parvez Amadrishi. And we have here, let us start. So a retraction is an art and we do retraction and counter retraction where we assist in the surgeries, okay? This is an art. We have to keep clean and then we can do it. Surgical assistants are frequently surgeons in training. They are in theater to help the senior surgeon and to learn as much as possible. So we have a, this is a teamwork, it includes an instrument table and then we have operation table here. Then we have anesthesiologist, it is on the head end. And then we have uh, piper anesthesia, it is from here. And then we have intravenous fluids running on one side. Chief surgeon stands usually on the side which is to be operated. <coughs> Suction machine is here. And usually then we have the operating lamp and we have circulating, uh, we have uh, nurse and then we have scrub nurse and then we have, then we have all, we have divided this presentation into three parts. One is preparation and then we have at surgery and then we have after surgery. So three parts, uh, you have to know three parts. So first thing is preparation assistant should uh, review the anatomy and operation before surgery so that they can anticipate and understand the actions of senior surgeon. They should start scrubbing first having checked that the patient is ready for theater and trainees should write important steps to proposed operation in brief on a board in the operated operation theater. And assistant should well be be well versed with the steps of surgery. Now uh, <clears throat> the scrub has nine steps on one side, nine steps on another side. There is another video on scrub how to scrub. Please go through that video. Pre-op uh, orders, blood investigation should be done. Specific tests for particular surgery. Check the fitness for surgery, prepare the parts, making the site and side of the operation, informed of written consent. Then we have, here is one more thing, you have to drape the part properly and cover all other unnecessary areas and you should um, wash with the betadine, scrub uh, with the betadine, uh, that part which is to be operated. and. Uh, so you can, for example, the anterior, we can see here the anterior superior elic supine here. Uh, this is the anterior superior elic supine. And we, here we have pubic tubercle here. We have, these are the landmarks and this is thigh crease. This is the thigh crease, this is this and here. We have two finger breadth from here. We give an incision here. This is an example, example on, uh, on the operating patient. Then we have at surgery, the assistant should try to provide the surgeon with the best access possible by placing and holding retractors and showing the surgeon the field where they are working. In instruments and retractors should always be asked for by name. You must remember the names of all the instruments and ask the instrument by name and give the instrument by name, okay? Then we have after surgery, the assistant should help the transfer the patient safely off the table and may write the operative note. They should keep a log of all operations attended and what they have learned from each case. They should be aware of complications both secondary to surgery and anesthetic that can happen post-operatively and should anticipate monitor the patient in post-surgical unit. If any complication occurs, uh, should manage accordingly. Proper analgesic should be given. Other supportive measures include fluid antibiotic ventilation if needed, monitoring vitals, SpO2 systemic examination. So there are tips for from the experts, the, the Professor Nick London, uh, Nick London Consultant Vascular Surgeon, University Hospital of uh, Leicester. If you are assisting and at an operation. Uh, always ask yourself the question, if I was doing this operation, how could the assistant best help me? Mr. David, then Miss uh, 
uh, ran on Harris's general, she is a general surgeon, a past a present of Association of Surgeons in Training. Always make sure you check the theater list the day before and read up on the operations. Your boss is more likely to let you scrub in or perform in part of a part if you show you have knowledge of the operation. Thank you very much. Please like and subscribe. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot.